Firestone Building Products presents Contractor E-Training. EPDM Large Hole or Cut. Measure the hole and add a minimum of three inches in each direction of the hole. On another piece of field membrane, mark the taken dimensions. Then cut the marked area to be used as a cover patch for the hole. Position the patch and mark along the edges one quarter inch out for quick seam splice tape. You can use your thumb along the edge as a guide. Remove the patch and apply single ply quick prime primer. The primer is only necessary where splice tape will be installed. Also apply primer to the back side of the patch where the splice tape will be installed. Measure and cut four pieces of quick seam splice tape. Apply splice tape with release paper edge lining up with the markings. Apply the splice tape pieces opposite one another first and roll in completely. Peel the release paper back before applying the other two pieces of splice tape. Again, install splice tape with release paper edge lining up with the markings. And repeat the process for the opposite side.
roll the entire splice tape area. With the release paper still on, place the patch in position. Once in position, remove the folded release papers first. Then carefully remove the remaining two release papers. With all the release papers removed, roll the entire patched area. Identify the areas where splice tape overlaps require quick seam T-joint covers. Apply primer to areas that require T-joint covers. Once the primer is flashed off, install T-joint covers. Once installed, roll the T-joint covers. Apply lap sealant around all T-joint covers and three inches in each direction of any seam intersecting the covers. Firestone Building Products. Nobody covers you better.